Good morning, Good morning. Hey, twin, twin auto, y'all. I'm gonna lock you. Hug you. Can I hug you? Oh, that's twin from Twin Auto, guys. He's over here on Grand River. So if you're looking for a car, that's one of them. That's the other half of them. Yeah. So y'all, you wanna? You're not one of the twins? Oh, he's the cousin. He looks like one of the twins. But y'all. He with him though, so what? Tell Al, is one up named Al, right? Yep, Al follow me on Facebook, tell him I said what up though. <laughs> so guys, today you're on Coffee and Conversation with your girl, Shaw Kenya. When you get a minute, just a few minutes, go to that YouTube channel, Shaw Kenya, and hit subscribe, I'm begging you. What I gotta do, I gotta get on my knees. I gotta get on my knees. What, 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 what I gotta do to get you to subscribe? To my YouTube channel. I gotta dance for you. Well, I gotta dance for you. What? What I gotta do? What? Uh, what's that? The Lawanda? That's what I call it. The Lawanda. On the dance show. What I gotta do? Y'all, I'm sorry. Y'all out here clowning in y'all lobby. Trying to get these people to subscribe to my damn channel. I gotta sing and dance for them, you know? So, guys, <laughs> gotta do something. So, guys, today we're gonna take a pause in parenting. Yeah, I know you can't take no breaks. There are no, you don't get no off days as a parent and you don't get no breaks. No, you don't. But we are going to take a pause because what you are outside of a parent is a person. <laughs> yeah, you, you are a person and you matter. Yes. So I'm going to turn it on you. I know we've been talking about me. And we've been talking about the influences and the environment that I had my children in. And I've been showing pictures, picture movies for y'all. I don't show y'all so much stuff. And we're going to get back to that. Yeah, we're going to get back to it because it's important. It's important to what we're trying to do here. <laughs> yeah, because we're we trying to do something here. I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission to repair every black family. As many as I can. As many as I can. If I can repair it in any kind of way, Lord Jesus, it can be just because y'all talking to each other now since you've been watching the videos. That's the way y'all weren't talking at first. It can be you done went back on a regular visitation schedule now. This baby can see his mama. This baby can see his daddy now. As before, you weren't letting them see him before you started watching my shows. It can be that y'all now have family meetings where y'all actually discuss the needs of the baby now all because y'all been watching my show yeah coffee and conversation so yeah that's i'm on a mission guys i'm on a mission so i hope you help me and you can help me by sharing the video yeah you can support me with these stars you can share the coffee and conversation from youtube you can go to my facebook page coffee and conversation i'm begging i'm pleading with you and share it so yep today i just want to talk about you but y'all say happy birthday to my little brother jay yep Oh my God, I can remember his first birthday he had with me. He was turning seven, and I had bought him these roller blades. <laughs> I bought him roller blades, I bought him a helmet, I bought him the ankle, the, the, the elbow. <laughs> he was looking like Robocop. <laughs> he was turning seven. Yes, got custody of Jay after my mom passed. So, yep, his first birthday with me, he was turning seven, and he turns 34, I think, today. So, say happy birthday to my little brother Jay. He's still here, and he, yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. So, y'all, today I just want to know what's going on with you. And Jay is also the reason why I started Attitude Adjustment Youth Program, but we're not going to talk about that today because it's his birthday. <laughs> I just want to say happy birthday, and I love him today. So, Y'all just want to know how your, your appointment's going, your therapy appointments. Because I know you done made them by now. Yeah, we've been doing this for a long time now. You got to come up out of denial. <laughs> yeah, you got to come out of denial. You know, you know something ain't right with you. Yeah. You've been talking about going to see somebody for a long time now. So this is it. This is the time. You got this little yellow girl on here constantly talking to you about it, letting you know it's okay. It's okay to do that. I actually encourage you to do so. Yeah, make your appointment. Go and see your therapist. Find out what's going on with you and do what's necessary to make sure you're better. Yeah. So I want to talk about that and all your goals. Yeah, that list that we made, your goals, the things that you say you want to do, things you've been saying you're going to do for a long time. Yeah, just want to, because you know, we don't do 90 day check ins anymore. Nope, I just asked you. <laughs> I just, I just ask you, yeah, whenever I feel like it, 
Yeah, ain't no waiting 90 days no more. I gave you that. That was in the beginning. I gave you that. Yeah, for a long time, we was just doing 90-day check-ins. I gave you that. And we, we at the point now where it's to just be a part of you. You know what you got to do. Yeah, for your own mental health. And then your goals. You, you just know it's time. Yeah, you've been putting it off too long. The kid's gone. Every excuse that you have for not to going back to school, not, not starting your own business, not being consistent with that weight loss, like whatever goals you had set for yourself, yeah, we can't blame it on nothing no more. Yeah, the kids grown now. They gone. They got their own life. Yeah, and ain't nothing really stopping you. You ain't really working all them hours anymore. Like, you got time on your hands. You you can do it now. Yeah, so, you have no excuses. So, I'm just checking in with you to see. You've been working on them goals. How's your therapy appointments going? And tomorrow, we're going to get back to the environment and the influences that I have my kids around. Yep, yesterday was good. I think yesterday we touched on just things that you want to pull out. And I told you how I was able to do it with mine, what I did, the steps I took. Yeah, because when it comes to parenting, you, you got it's steps. It's like a process. <laughs> yeah, other than that, your child just growing up. Me and my son was talking about that yesterday. Yeah, you're not actually raising your child. If you're not teaching them anything, you're not putting nothing in them, you're not really raising them. They're just growing up, getting bigger and bigger, more ignorant. Yeah, but if you raising them, that means you putting stuff in them, you talking to them, you walking through. Just like I told y'all about cooking, you got to have the baby in there. You got to have them assist you. You got to have them, you know, whenever you're teaching them how to cook or do something. So that's it for coffee and conversation with your girl. She came. Y'all got to get over to that building. I'm out. Mm -hmm.